The brief to the architects was to design a school that was going to meet the needs of children who were deaf and speech and language impaired. And so the very first thing that we needed to consider was the fact that we needed very, very good acoustics. And so that's an unusual sort of slant for architects to actually take. They all obviously want the school to look as fabulous as possible. They're not really thinking about how it sounds and how the impact of the acoustics, um, you know, will sort of help children in their learning and teaching. There was an acoustician on the design team, which really meant that every single time we made any change to the building, we had the, the acoustician um, test what difference that was going to make to the purity of the sound that the children would get. And it really has worked because the children um, are very, very much more settled here. Um, the old school was fabulous, but it had very high ceilings and there was a lot of reverberation, a lot of echo. And when you're a digital hearing aid user, you're getting a lot of sound, extraneous sound, um, which makes it difficult to identify what's the very most, the most important sound to listen to. Here, that's been done away with completely. Hi there. Donaldson's new home and the love go well and truly open. This site is marvellous. Now, for me, it's particularly uh, interesting because, I mean, I was born two or three hundred yards down the road. I spent my entire childhood there. I went to nursery school across there. For me, it's wonderful that a great Scottish institution has, uh, has come to a place that I know so well and love. and. Uh, um, I think Donaldson's will be so happy in the Live Go, and the Live Go will be so happy to have Donaldson's. I thought the Janice, the principal of the school, made an important point. You know, see, a lot of people think Donaldson's is about hearing. It's actually about listening, about listening and communication and enabling people to take part, and that's what's going on in full measure. And although the, the building's wonderful, the facilities are great, you know, the heart of the school is the commitment of the staff and the enthusiasm of the pupils. That's the heart of the school.